How's it going everyone? Welcome to some more Major Arc news and there is quite a bit uh, this week. So, we're excited to see so many of you exploring Aberration since launch. Whether you're taming under the spell of the Adorable Cosmo or taking on the dangerous Yi Ling, it's been great to see players navigating the new map, content, and creatures. So let's jump in on the latest live ops. Nakata's free version of Astreos launching soon, a mod spotlight, and Arc Pox new mod list for this month. Woo! So, this I didn't expect. So, obviously we have Astraos. Immerse yourself in a Greek-inspired world spanning a massive 264 kilometers squared where majestic mountain ridges and marble light cliffs give way to white beaches and a paradise of cherry blossoms and a full Sakura biome. Explore ancient Greek ruins and temples or sail vast oceans with custom Greek trireme ships. I cannot pronounce that. I've never been to Greece. Don't judge me. Face off against powerful new bosses, alpha dino variants, and enhanced loot and a fearsome mini boss lurking in mysterious caves. Prepare for mythological enemies hiding in the shadows while gearing up custom cosmetic skins and standalone mods for structures and ships the free version will launch on october 10th available day one for crossplay with the premium version slater for slated for later in the year and as we all know free for free mod maps that will eventually become premium mod maps are usually kind of yeah so i have mixed thoughts towards it could be good could be bad you know we never know but uh live ops updates so these are pretty important because they have fixed quite a few things in aberration that needed fixing uh so the live ops team focused on addressing crash issues and they've made solid progress uh they've worked hard on playstation and rendering issues on playstation and they'll work towards other fixes and gameplay bugs in the coming weeks to highlight a couple of fixes still in progress rock drake gliding and ascension issues a Steam server version was deployed today with a fix for Rock Drake Gliding, which is now live for all players. We're also prioritizing a fix for the Ascension issue, which is expected to go out with a planned major patch next week. Of course, this isn't exhausted. The pipeline is chocked full of fixes that will soon be ready to go live. So, uh, they're also working with AMD... 
uh, and they have a good, uh, they're making good progress to a solution. Some players have reported success in eliminating the GPU crash by rolling back their drivers to the following patch, which you can click there. Uh, yeah, and then you have your mod spotlights, Mark Apocalypse servers that are wiped on October 11th. Uh, you have your bonus rates, and then of course the community corner with the fan art, my favorite part. I love the fan art, never gets old. And then of course your photo mode. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Um, but anyway, that's just about it for, uh... This week's ARC news. Something else that they're doing, though, is the Pyromane. They uh, are work are planning on possibly nerfing the Pyromane. I know a lot of people are upset that the Pyromane spawns on Aberration. Um, I personally, I'm not necessarily upset. But I do think it is a flaw to Aberration. It doesn't really bother me that much. But I do think it is a flaw and they should remove it. Uh, the only two maps I think the Pyromane should spawn on. Story map wise, it should only be on Scorched Earth. And... Uh non-canon dlc wise the center because that's where it made its debut was on the center and again a lot of people say pyromane should be a mod so yeah they i honestly think they should stop releasing the pyromane on every map because that's just kind of daft uh i wonder what the nerf is going to be i wonder if you're not going to be able to swim in lava anymore I wonder if that's what the nerf is going to be, or if you can't switch it to a shoulder pet while you're mounted on it, or maybe it doesn't provide insulation, as much insulation as it used to, so you may have to start using the Kaleen soup again. Uh, I'm not really sure. Uh, but anyway, yeah, that's going to do it for this week's Arc News, so hey, I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, if you did, smash that like button, subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time.